hello hello good morning good afternoon good evening depending on your time zone welcome to my youtube channel my name is Obanje Joseph please 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 subscribe to this channel share a like as well as drop a comment on the comment section so today we are going to be continuing a series on the structures structures of political party so um the first structure we talked about before was the party working committee party working committee so of course the political party working committee is made up of the chairman the vice chairman the second you know the secretary the, uh, the um, assistant secretary the treasurer the assistant treasurer the um auditor you know you know organizing secretary party you know women leader youth leader and stuff like that so today we're going to be looking at another structure of political party called the board of trustees or what some people call the bot board of trustees okay so now now board of trustees one of the organs of political party that is made up of elders and experienced members you know that ensures you know experienced members that ensure that party continue continues to remain united and in one piece now it is made up of men and women of high integrity who are most times referred to as the conscience of the political party most of them are experienced statesmen and women who played key role in the formation of the political party now parties benefit a great deal from these wise you know from the, you know from their wise counsel at critical moment now the bot is also saddled with the responsibility of ensuring highest standards of morality in all the activities of the party by acting as the conscience of the party with power to call to order to order any officer of the party whose conduct fall you know falls below you know the norms and show high morality of members of the party and the party enjoys a good image before the larger you know populace and in a good political health so the uh, the party bot is you know is one of the structures of the party that is put in place to actually harmonize coordinate review and advise on policies programs and activities of the party you know at the national level you know to actually coordinate the sourcing of party funds mediate in disputes between the executive and the legislative arm of government undertake any other functions you know and activities as may be referred to it you know by the party national working committee okay so those are the things you know so they are actually there as the conscience of the party okay so that is actually you know the bot that's the function of the bot the bot is actually uh, you know like i said is a conscience of the party and it's made up of very experienced you know elder statement that you know are there to ensure that airing party members are actually brought you know uh, called to order and if there are you know loop or, or if there are um disagreements between the arms or the organs of government you know they step in okay so that is actually you know for the bot now the next structure we are going to be talking about is the party political party political party caucus political uh, political party caucus now according to the wikipedia 2009 party caucus is a closed meeting of party members within a legislative body to decide on question of policy or leadership now in the parliament there are party caucuses that ensure that politicians especially those in the parliament do not deviate from the party's manifesto and ideologies okay so party caucuses are strategic to political parties because they are in the legislature which is an organ of government to protect the interest of the political party in general so members of the party caucus are the ones who set legislative agenda you know select committee members and chairs 
now this process takes place you know for both the sen you know for both the upper chamber and the lower chamber okay so the party caucus is divided along party lines especially in country where the dominant parties are few so party caucuses explicitly favor one party or the other okay and indeed are directed you know are direct outgrowths of the political party in the legislature so what we're saying is that the party caucuses do not exercise the same degree of influence in organizing the legislature so the increased partisan competition in political parties has actually made party caucus you know increasingly important okay so they are very very important you know within the legislature another organ of political party that we'll talk about is the party working committee now the working committee of a political party is made up of all the officers of the party you know they are to ensure the policies made by the executive committee are implemented to the latter okay so the you know the party working committee is the organ of the party that is responsible for the day-to-day -day, you know administration of the party and it is also responsible to the executive committee and performs you know you know the functions that is actually assigned to it by the executive committee okay so now it is actually good to point out here that the party working committee at the national level is called the national working committee now the zonal level it is actually called the zonal working committee at the state level it is called you know state working committee you know you know uh, you know and it goes down like that okay now uh, you know at, uh, we have talked about it you know under the senatorial level uh, you know we also have the um local government local government um we have local government award you know uh, party working committee as well so so those are just the major things now another organ that we talk about is the executive committee of a political party now at the national level the party executive committee is called the national executive committee at the zonal level and at the state level it is called the zona executive committee and the state executive committee respectively now this organ of political party is a policy making body of the party now they meet from time to time to make policies that will be obeyed and respected by all and sundry within the political party now now a party you know is considered to be structurally strong okay and fortified when it has a very strong branch okay in the component units of what of a country now in a okay so in a you know in a federation okay where there is a state and local government a party is said to be very formidable when it has a when it has branches in the states and in the local government as well as you know the wards okay so in the states a party is expected to have the state executive while in the local government you know the party is also expected to have the local government party executive and the same thing you know with the words as well so all these organs all these organs of political party you know and structures of a party are you know are there you know to actually make the party to be very solid okay and during national election these are the structures of political party that actually make the political party win election so when they say my party is a formidable party i have structures on ground everywhere it means that at the state level you are very formidable at the local government level you are very formidable at the world level you are very formidable so uh, if a political party is actually formidable like that from the national to the state to the local government as well as the world then such a political party is actually very formidable and strong okay so when politicians talk boast about you know having structures everywhere in the country this is actually the structure that we actually talk about we, you know we have talked about the uh, working committee the we have talked about 
the working committee, the executive committee, the caucus, you know, and all of that. All of these, you know, organs of political party make it, you know, make it, you know, very formidable in states where they actually exist. Thank you very much.